did you feel like you hung with that and, and just kind of rode it out to, to when you got hot in the fourth quarter? Yeah, um, you know, I think I handled it, you know, pretty well. Um, you know, just just had to rally sometime. We knew we were close, you know, we were just one drive away from getting it, getting things going, and it felt good to finally get it going in the fourth quarter. Was it frustrating at all, or is that just part of part of the game? Uh, it's part of the game, but it was frustrating because uh, we knew we were so close to breaking through and, you know, getting points on the board and getting drives together. So I uh, just got to focus this week on starting faster. What are you going to do to start faster? Um, yeah, I think just, um, you know, trying to practice and perfect, you know, just be perfect in practice and uh, prepare um, for this game as best as possible. How did you see D.Y. step up on Saturday or for that game? Yeah, very. Um, you know, D.Y. is a great player along with Fergie, and uh, it's, it's good to see him out in the open field and break loose a couple times. Talk a little bit about your freshman receiver, especially Mikey Dudek. Yeah. Had a pretty good game. He caught a couple of big, big balls for you. Yeah, Mikey had a great game. So did Malik, uh, another young guy. Um, they they're true freshmen. They're just learning. Um, they're doing a great job, and uh, they're going to be a big part of our success this year. What did you tell Mikey after he dropped those two passes and then kind of calm him down a little bit? Uh, I didn't tell him anything. Uh, he, he knew he knows what happened. You know, uh, there's no point to dwell on it. I'm still going to go to him if he drops it. So uh, he made a big couple catches there and, you know, got our offense moving. I think with you, you're okay. you're repeat everything. <laughs> um, you know, now, now we're in the second game, do you just feel like a little more jitters out of the system? And, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Um, just feel more comfortable now, um, getting back into football. Uh, felt good to get a, a win. Uh, Got to start faster this week. Obviously, Western Kentucky, everyone's looking at their offense and just how dynamic that is. Um, what, have you, what do you know about their defense or the way you know, yeah. they're just playing uh, just watch the first game. Uh, good defense, very talented. Um, you know, like you said, the offense uh, puts up a lot of points. So um, just got to focus on this week on doing the little things and start faster. How important is it to kind of not get caught up in a like quarterback duel or you know trying to like match yeah. that? Yeah, you just got to worry about um, yourself and, and the offense. We can't get caught up on what they're doing on the other side of the ball. Just try to keep our defense off the field as much as possible. Thanks. How do you assess the game after looking at it from, from your performance and from what do you hope to do better in the second game? Oh uh, yeah, I have a lot of room for improvement. Um, you know, started really slow. I uh, need to pick things up there, but um, getting the, the win is the most important thing. So that's all we can ask for. Is it harder to get on the same page in the game, like atmosphere with all the new receivers? You guys kind of try to pull each other out, shed some light on what it's really like, not just in practice, but actually being in the game, speed against another team. Kind of like yeah, it's more difficult in the game. You know, just because it's happening so fast, and you know, you can't just go on the side and throw routes or something you do in practice. So. Um, but, you know, I thought we did well um, finally getting on the same page, um, you know, and, and getting the win. You think there's – you had enough go right in the fourth quarter and at the end of the game you looked like you were feeling pretty good about the offense, you know, hey, this is, this is what we want to do, right? Yeah. That, that, that there should be some carryover into the early portion of this next game? Yeah, that's what we hope. Um, you know, I think in the fourth quarter we kind of showed what we can be. And, uh, you know, got people excited, got us excited, but um, just have to carry through that through four quarters. You know, we spent a lot of time talking to you about the fact that that was your first game in a long time, but you weren't the only one. I mean, all your, almost all your receivers were out there in an Illini uniform for the first time, a couple of them in a college game for the first time. Did you see them kind of warm to the situation too, Mikey and, and Malik, particularly sort of like get the hang of college football? Absolutely. Um, you know, I think – like you said, a lot of young guys out there on, in the skill positions, and um, you know Mikey and Malik, and you know even Geronimo. You know his first time playing D1 football, so um, you know they did a great job. And as the game went on, you could tell they got more comfortable with the game. So uh, it was exciting to see that.